anytime and anywhere. The fear of your life may suddenly come to you. You cannot delay the desperately dangerous situation. We will protect your life. Lifeguard Nanung Tech CPR Guide If you find a collapsed patient, tap the shoulders of the patient lightly and check the consciousness. If the patient is unconscious, call EMS or 911 and request for an AED equipment around. After finding the chest compression point, press the chest 30 times at the speed of 100 times per minute into at least 5 cm depth. At that time, press the point with both elbows straight and being vertical to the patient's body. Press the chest 30 times at the speed of 100 times per minute into at least 4 cm depth with the hand in the case of infant less than 25 kg. After you secure the airway exactly as holding the patient's forehead with one hand and lifting the chin with the other hand, in the status covering the patient's nose completely and his entire mouth, do artificial respiration twice by slowly blowing your breath that the chest comes up for one second. When doing artificial respiration, keep your eyes on the patient's chest. Keep pressing the chest and doing artificial respiration until the rescue team comes. 5-Minute Miracle Heart Plus All-in-One Type Check whether the patient is conscious or not. If the patient is unconscious, request for help on EMS or 911 and for Heart Plus All-in-One Type. Do CPR with 30-time chest compression and two-time artificial respiration in turn. If Heart Plus has arrived, turn on the power of it. Take off the patient's jacket and wipe out any water on the patient's body or remove the pollutant. If the pad adherence check light is turned on with the voice of pad adherence command, open the upper film of cartridge and take out the electrode pad. After removing the white adhesive paper of an opened electrode pad, check the adhesive position. For adults, put the pad on the right chest and left side. And for infant, Put it on the chest compression point and back. After putting the pad, pass to ECG check light. If you are away from the patient and wait according to the voice instructions, automatic ECG check will be carried out. In case of a patient with arrhythmia, the equipment will be automatically carried out the high voltage charge. And this is the electric shock preparing process so the electric shock button will flicker with the voice instruction for being away from the patient. Push the flickering electric shock button and give the shock to the patient. The energy for electric shock will be automatically discharged unless pushing the button within 20 seconds. After giving the electric shock, do CPR according to the instructions. In case of a patient without arrhythmia, do CPR immediately. After repeating chest compression and artificial respiration five times, Heart Plus analyzes the ECG again. In case of a patient with arrhythmia in this time after the second ECG analysis, pass to the preparation of electric shock and give it again. Do CPR according to the instructions. Repeat ECG check and CPR in the above order and keep going them until the rescue team arrives. Turn off the power of Heart Plus All-in-One Type. If you use the pad, the effective date on the cartridge is over and the protection film of electro pads outside of cartridge are damaged. Change a new cartridge. If you remove the film on the cartridge, push, pull, open the inside fastener. The cartridge will be separated from the equipment. If you firstly insert a new cartridge on the opposite side of fastener as making the label upward and push the fastener, the cartridge will be completely changed. You can receive a new cartridge by contacting with our consumer center. Before and after using, check the product and cartridge. System self-test is periodically performed on the regular time and as pad adherence ECG check 
CPR indication lamp will be lightened and flickered in order. And finally, the system will change on the standby mode. If you'd like self-test by yourself, simultaneously push the button for adults and children for over one second long. As PAD adherence, ECG check, CPR indication lamp will be lightened and flickered in order. Self-test will be performed. If the batteries over 80% are exhausted, as the error status lamp flickers and the voice instruction, the battery is low, change the battery before checking the patient's status. Immediately contact with the customer service center and replace the battery into a new one. Dangerous situation that your life is threatened. The most important thing is fast and exact first aid. With Nanumtech's Life Frontier, automated external defibrillator, protect your healthy daily life and family happiness.